My answer to this question until Saturday was no, absolutely not. The greatest goal getter, the finest number 9 there ever has been in the world for me was Gerd Muller. But after this season, I probably would have to change my answer. You might have seen Robert Lewandowski scoring goals for fun since he joined Bayern Munich from Borussia Dortmund. Those 5 goals in 9 minutes against Wolfsburg are still etched in the Guinness Book of World Records, but it isn't the first time that the Bundesliga witnessed such a prolific goal scorer. Gerd Müller, the West Germany and Bayern Munich legend, was a player on another level. His career at Bayern Munich lasted for 15 years, scoring 565 goals. His 40-goal season had come in 1971-72 Bundesliga season, roughly 50 years ago. And that wasn't all. The year 1972 saw Gerd Müller score hold your breath, 85 goals in a calendar year. No player in the world was able to beat this record until 2012 when Leo Messi put together 91 goals in a single year. Of course, people can say that La Liga has 20 teams while Bundesliga has 18 and it was far easier for Messi to score for Barcelona considering the team he had back then. But I respect statistics and they do tell you how good a goal scorer Gerd Müller was. No other player came close to breaking Gerd Müller's 40 goal in a season record in the Bundesliga for the last 49 years until Robert Lewandowski did. First of all, I would like to clarify that Leo Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo are not classical number 9s. They are wide forward players, hence cannot be compared to Lewandowski in this category. So, what makes Lewandowski special? It isn't just his goal-scoring ability that saw him win FIFA the Best European Player of the Year awards last year. He would most likely win the Ballon d'Or as well this year. Lewandowski is the most complete number 9 you would ever see. A lot of strikers have excellent knack for goals, but the way Lewandowski moves in and around the penalty box is unparalleled. We have seen Messi and Ronaldo dominate world football for more than a decade. While Messi has been exceptional in terms of his control on the ball, vision, bringing his teammates into the game, and of course, converting chances, Ronaldo had created a fear factor. Ronaldo often scares defenders with his sheer presence, especially during his final 3-4 years at Real Madrid. He had the ability to find himself behind almost every goal-scoring opportunity that his teammates would create. With Lewandowski, it is a very similar case. The way Lewandowski manages to find space inside the box, no matter how many defenders are present, is one of the finest traits. He might be 32 years old, but his fitness is that of a player who is into his early 20s. Lewandowski might not be the sort of forward who can outmuscle giant defenders, but he uses his agility to find blind spots around defenders with surprising ease. You know, many people can say that it is easy for a striker who is playing with this Bayern Munich team that dominates possession and attacks so much. It isn't as easy for the striker to maintain a high energy level and time his movements cleverly, especially when you're on the wrong side of 30s. Lewandowski might not be as fast as Kylian Mbappe or Neymar, but the timing of his runs and the movements are probably better than the PSG duo. There was a time when Lewandowski even played as a number 10. I'm talking about his Borussia Dortmund days under Jurgen Klopp. Lewandowski would often argue with Klopp as to why a striker like him is being deployed as a number 10. But years later, Lewandowski realized how that change of role helped him understand the game in a different manner altogether. Lewandowski owes a lot to Klopp for helping him take his game to the level he is today. Not many strikers manage to keep the sort of shape Lewandowski has after turning 30. Even Sergio Aguero, one of the Premier League's top scoring players, is 32, same as Lewandowski. Luis Suarez was shown the exit door by Barcelona last year when he was 33. And Lewandowski, he keeps aging like fine wine. I have absolutely no doubt that Lewandowski, with this level of fitness, can keep scoring 30 plus goals for Bayern Munich every season for the next 2-3 years at least. Who knows, he might even have a longevity like Zlatan Ibrahimovic if he remains injury-free. I know there would be a lot of people who believe that there hasn't ever been a better pure striker than the Brazilian Ronaldo in world football. Their sentiment isn't entirely wrong. 
a fully fit Ronaldo Di Nazario was phenomenal, probably the most difficult player to defend against. See, according to me, the tag of best striker ever should not be given purely on the basis of comparison of two players on the basis of their best but also at their worst. Fitness, disciplinary reasons, saw Ronaldo lacking the career longevity a striker of his caliber should have had. At the peak of his powers, Ronaldo never had competition and probably never will, but that shouldn't be the only basis. I have ultimate respect for the Brazilian great, but the consistency and discipline Lewandowski has shown is unmatched and that is why for me, he is the best pure number 9 there ever has been. That was all from me today. I hope you guys enjoy the episode. Of course, some of you would not agree with what I have to say, but this is my interpretation just like you have yours. Do share your views in the comment section and please hit the subscribe button. Till the next time, Auf Wiedersehen.